Right, so I'm just doing a small modification on the driving lights. This is all thanks to Glyn Hudson. Um, there is a YouTube channel where he has a lot of updates on his own self-build electric camper van using a Nissan AMV. And one of the main problems with this um, camp with this van is if you're trying to use the main battery pack as a leisure battery and um, have it on at night and things like that, these daylight driving lights are always on so you can't turn them off and when you're parked up you don't want to really have them on all night so uh, this little relay that goes in that goes into this here is um, is a thing that controls them so all that I've done is to rewire um, let's have a look so there is a just a bit of wire going in here going all the way back round and that's going back into the cabin and I've got that wired up to a switch so at the moment you can see it's reading 13.2 volts that will be turned on if I put the relay in that will control the driving light now if I go back behind here and push this switch I haven't got it fixed in place yet but if I push that and then go back around and have a look as you can see zero volts so that is complete that turns off the relay that operates there so this is a single pole double throw relay i think so when the when one coil is off one set is one switch is closed and when the coil is on the other switch is closed and the other one's open so i think that's what this is and i think that's how it works i'm just not sure where all of those go hmm yeah I'm not sure how that entirely operates but what I do know is that numbers one and two is positive and negative so that is the, that which is the coil on and off so um, what I've done is wire it up into the negative and um, and that will allow me to switch the driving lights on from inside the cabin um, and make life a lot easier Right, so here we go. I put everything back together. We have the driving daylight relay back in place. And then we have a wire coming out of the back here, going round, following, following where I wired up the other inverter cable into the back here. And then when we come around, I have wired it. Let's see, can you see it? I know you can't just back there and I've wired it down to this switch under the dash so that it is out of the way and if I switch that if I switch it on there we go relay is on and the driving lights are working so there we go this is what I'm gonna do this is how I've got it set up so that when I am parked up I just press that switch and off they go and I can leave the contactors engaged for using the utility battery at night, all night. Um, and there we are. All done. All done. Just got to put this cap back on and we are good, whichever way it goes on.